Hey everybody, it is Crafty Glamper 77 and I'm here with a few bags to do. Merry Christmas. Yeah, shot for a thumbnail, but I'm sure I won't like it. Um, I'm gonna get started, just get right into it. Um, thank you guys if you are watching this video and you're new, thank you so much for watching my channel. Um, if you're a repeat watcher, thank you so much. Um, for jumping back on here with me and sharing me sharing some of your time with me okay um there's a couple of orders one is my husband's where he got like a text you know and they gave him some kind of special well he's not here so the prices are on his phone so what i'll do is when i upload this video today's monday the 18th i'll try to upload it tomorrow i have another one on my phone that i did this past weekend i was going to upload today at work and then i forgot my phone at home on the charger so I might have two videos coming up tomorrow um, but anyway my daughter's getting out of school soon and I get really flustered when people are here and I'm trying to do a haul I don't know it just breaks my concentration so I'm gonna jump in here this is for my husband's order for me um, I absolutely love these mashers and I already have one I actually have one for the camper and one for the house. So, if you haven't seen them, oh, I was looking for the price. I just got done saying I didn't have any prices. Um, I was just listening to my Christmas station, and I wish I could have soft background music while I'm doing these hauls. It's so quiet. Um, just something to make it cozy. Well, this one's a little different because my other ones are like perfectly round. And this is like an oval flat shape, but these things are good and solid. I mean, you could hurt somebody with this, but potato masher, whatever. I use this as my meat masher. Like I said, I have one for the camper. I have one for here at the house and I wanted just to get another one in case something happens. Um, they're not, they're not expensive. So I would want to say that maybe it was $3 or, um, under not for sure. So I've never, ever, ever bought their jeans before. And I was so mixed up on the reviews. Real fast, here's one of my shirts I made the other day with Blanche Devereaux from the Golden Girls. I put it on a sweatshirt. I put the little print on the front and I put my bigger iron on on the back. So, yeah. Um, but anyway, I broke down and got some jeans and I read and read and read the reviews, but I don't know. I have a feeling it's gonna be a hit and miss. Um, I, I have lost 30 pounds or whatever, but I got an extra large, which I want to say is a 14. I'm not sure. Um, when you read people's reviews and pictures, some people put their heights, their weight, all that stuff. But I don't, I don't know. I still was so wishy-washy on what size to get. Here's my wonderful little piece of paper. I really do like the jeans. They're cute as can be. Um, they've got, a lot of people don't like the white, maybe if it just depends on how much of it and where, but I actually like this distressed, um, wash from the jeans and they go all the way down and they are wide leg and they're frayed at the bottom, which I absolutely love that. Um, here's the pock, the back, very cute. That's the only distressing is back here on what's on the pockets. Um, does have a nice little tag in here. It's 85% cotton, 13 poly, and two elastane. And yes, I did get the extra large, which I'm pretty sure, pretty sure that was a 14. Um, I'm very short. So I wish you guys could see, but literally with me having them like even all the way up underneath the girls, my chest here. I don't even think Beal, um, Beal's boots with heels will work. They're literally laying all the way across my foot onto the floor about this much. That's how long they are. So for them to be like right where I want them, even with boots, I'd have to pull the little suckers all the way up here. And that's not happening. So they might shrink a little that's more of the, not usually so much the length, but we'll see. Some of them are holes 
And, oh, I guess they all are. I thought some was just like real tight, distressed. But I guess they are kind of holes. But they're really cute. One pocket. I mean, one button. Wow, I need to start this over. I'm a hot mess. Thinking that she's coming home and I need to hurry. So it's just... <clears throat> got me all the mess we're getting our first little snow here today in indiana it's really pretty um well, i like those jeans if they don't fit me maybe emmy will like them but i honestly think i need to lose a few more pounds for those too um can't give you the price because i don't know and i got this and this these four things i'm going to show you um, on my haul that I haven't uploaded that I thought I was going to um, do today, but I forgot my phone. I got two, two, or two pieces of it, and it's in that haul, and it's a contour. It has two different colors at the each end. And then the other thing, I don't remember, but I showed the two makeup things because they sent it separate, I guess, you know, in case they didn't want it to get all over the other items. They sent the other four items today, so it was six total in this order, and I had a credit. So for, for those two makeup things I've showed and these four things I'm going to show here, I only paid $7.51 for six items. The two makeups in the other haul that I haven't shown and these four here, and I paid $7.51. This sweater alone is $23.98 to show you how much credit I had. I was so excited. Um, I got me a sweater. I think I like it, but it's kind of big. Like I said, it's regular $23.98. I would put it on, but I'm sweating almost here in this front room with a sweatshirt on. Actually, I think I'll take off my house slippers. That might help, but... um. Here's the things. It's kind of wide, but of course you're gonna, I always kind of have them over me, crossed a little bit. And I'm, you know, whole, I don't know, blah, blah, blah. I really am in just in a flustery mood today. So if you're new here, I apologize. I'm just not, I'm normally all over the place, but today I'm like an extra hot mess. So I apologize in advance. I'm just gonna try not to rattle and just get with it to the point but anyway, it's a very nice, I think you can see the material there. I love the colors. It's very, I hope you can see by that of how soft this is, you guys. It is really, really soft. Nicely made. Sorry, that was my drink that just kind of spilled all over the table. I told you, I'm a mess. <laughs> ah! Okay, I don't want to do this, but I'm going to. I'm going to run over to my kitchen real fast and get paper towels because that was actually a sugary drink. Sorry, guys. But this is a glass table I have, and the drawers slide out both ends. So the glass has a crack right there, and I don't want this stuff to get inside of it. Oh, my word. Maybe I should start this over. I actually have gotten two or three minutes into this haul and I've stopped it twice. This is my third time trying to do it because I just feel like it's just ugh, a mess. Okay. Oh, shoot fuzzy. Far. Kind of dripped off the edge onto the floor. Ugh. I guess I should know this is how my day is going to be. I went to bed after one, woke up after three, could not fall back asleep, got up, went to bed about five. My alarm went off at six because her boss is six, so I had to go in for the early shift. And I'm just, I don't know, I think it's just really hitting me all of a sudden. But anyway, let's just get back with this haul. It's all cleaned up now, um, kind of, sort of. Well, these are not spill proof. I will tell you that much. Mr. Grinch kind of made a mess. Maybe I need to get you away in case I bump you again. Really not much left in there anyways. I shouldn't have had it here. Okay. 
But anyway, here's, I got the sweater. I done throwed it on the floor. I was going to get the, here it is. Guys, I'm not joking when I say it's really, really nice and heavy. It'll be good for a cold day. It's a large <clears throat> polyester. Very soft, comfortable. Very soft and comfortable. I, I love this. Love, love. Oh, okay. This is wet. So, wow, I got it all over everything. <laughs> okay. Seven dollars and something for those six items, right? The two makeups and the other haul you haven't seen yet. These four items. That alone was almost twenty-four. That what was that? This is one, two, okay, two, three, four. And then I just got these. I hope you can see them okay. I paid eighty seventy-eight cents. Are you upside down? No. I'm gonna get my nails done Friday again. You really can't tell anymore, but I had Charlie Brown, Woodstock, and Snoopy on a couple um, of my nails. But I'm gonna get them redone. And I thought these were so pretty. I wanna get them done this red again, but then I think on these two fingers, I might go silver sparkle, but since this is red, and put it on top of it, the two silver ones. We'll see. All right, so 78 cents. There was a price adjustment. Oh my gosh, I forgot my scissors. I did I forget my scissors? <clears throat> oh, hallelujah. I didn't. 89 cents, and I got a price adjustment. These are really cute little earrings. Very pretty. Let me see if I can hold it back here. Very pretty little earrings. I love those. And they come, which is good because this ear has a tear. These are Timu earrings that I have on these cute little snowmen. Still got my Timu watch band on, Timu iron on. Um, no, this hat was from Hobby Lobby, but very cute, love it. But anyway, I was saying the backing is the kind that I like because I have the tear on this one. I have double holes. This one's fine, but this one right here got tore. You just shanked on one too many times, I guess. So that's the kind of backing that I use. I buy them in 50 quantity through Timu. But that's cool it came with that because a lot of times it's just the little ones. And both of them actually did. So those were really, really cute. I like those. 89 cents for PR. Price adjustment. I. It's PA for price adjustment, but I always put PR. Like price refund. Just one of those things, I guess don't ask. I have because I don't have an answer for it. Um, buy one, get one free. And it was 208 is what I paid for these. <clears throat> Number two. Oh, they're both two. So I just got, I guess, two of the same color. Boy, that ring. Pretty little boxes, though. I like the little cute lips on there. Let's open one, because evidently the same number. It's going to be the same kind. I've already turned the fan on. I hope everybody else is having a really good day. <laughs> I just feel like today is the true definition of a Monday for me. <laughs> but that's okay. That is okay, because when I get done, I'm just going to chill on the couch with Harley. She's, you can't see her, but she is already right over there waiting on me. Um, if I move this too much, I know I'm gonna mess everything up. Okay, it says Damon Poo, Damon Poo, Starry Sparkling Lipstick, number two. That sounds gross. Beautiful, 
beautiful makeup case or lipstick case. I absolutely love that. And whoa. Oh my word. And here I said I don't like pink. I thought it was more of like a brownish color in there. Does this just go with like lip changing stuff? Mm. Let's see. I'm going to use this. Get a corner where I know it wasn't rubbing on the floor. Let me put it on this. It's real soft and subtle. Honestly. Mm, it smells like glue. Mm, here I go. And, oof, pink. Hmm. And honestly, I really... <clears throat> Excuse me. Don't like the smell. So I'm just gonna take it off my lips. It's a real pretty thing. Lipstick holder, but I really... I don't know. I'm not real crazy about the smell. And it's got a nice little snap, so you know it's together. Um, if I buy one, get one free, I know it's the same and it has the same number, so we won't waste our time opening up that. Um, I'll put my littles in here and we'll get to the big bag. This was $2.47. I got the light golden brown. And it's supposed to be, ugh, it's kind of a mess. Where are you? Hmm. Okay, so that's where you clip it. So you probably want to get all this hair out. Sorry, it's just kind of a mess. You must have to kind of foo-foo and work it a little bit yourself. I will say the teeth are, yeah, they're kind of hard to open. So that's good. Once you get your hair piece on, I guess it's not going anywhere. Um, just supposed to kind of be like cute little messy bun. When you have your hair up, you just clip this in the back and it just gives you, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know why I bought it. I'm not even sure it's really even my hair color. It's not particularly. It's kind of hard to judge those in there too when you're buying these. I started to get a really long one because I love to have like really long hair. But you know what? I went with the short one and it was again $247. Don't ask. I don't have an answer. I should have probably just went with the big one. 1170 and I got this in a large. I'm trying to go all crazy with XXLs and extra larges and stuff. And I do read the reviews. Um, I do like this already. This is like a real sweatshirt material. Love it. And it says Coors, the original Coors Cowboy. This is what it looks like. I love the pink and black on the gray. It is hooded. It's really, really soft. It does not have any drawstrings, which is fine with me. Um, it does have your pocket, and it's the one pocket. You guys, I'm going to push you down. Not sideways, but... Because you're looking, seeing more of me than the items, and that's not what you want. So here, maybe I can, that would be better, right? Sure. So, right here, um, it does go past my booty, and that's how I like it. So that is a large, I think on this one I read, some people said it was sizing kind of big. 
This, you guys, is a very nice, this feels just like a sweatshirt. It's a thinner sweatshirt. It's not thick like this one that I got at Hobby Lobby. But my point is, it's not spongy. And I, it might be polyester mixed with something. But this is a very nice material. I like it. It's 100% polyester, but it's really nice polyester. Like I said, they're not thick sweatshirts. They're thin, which is nice. I like that. So there's that. Eleven seventy. No price adjustment on that. Sure be nice. I don't quite get those price adjustments as much as I used to, but I did get one yesterday for a shirt that's in a sweatshirt that's in another haul. And it was four dollars and thirty-five cents that I got back. I paid eleven nineteen and I did get a price adjustment for this one. I really hope I like this. Feels nice and soft. Um, it's not soft inside. It's almost like your terry cloth, but it's not rough or anything. It's nice and smooth. I got this in a 1XL. I don't know. I, I must have based it on reviews. It is long, which I like long arms hanging over the top of my hand. It doesn't bother me. Really smooth. It's really a soft, nice soft material. It's a pretty pink. And that's what it has on the front. And I love it. But yes. It's a pretty pink sweatshirt and it will also cover my booty so I like that yeah stitching is all really hmm usually really good so I don't like it if I pull I'm not even really pulling see and the stitching is kind of loosey loo right there I might it's actually loose threading Kind of all through there. See, it should be tight where you just see the line, the seam. You shouldn't be able to see every little stitch thing like that. So, I don't know. I may try to get a price adjustment on that. We'll see. $12.37. This is about the same that I pay for sweatshirts at Hobby Lobby. It's like $12 around there, I think. Um, but I've got a couple of sublimations to do. And they do better on things that are polyester. It's not going for this one. This is actually going to go some, something else in the bag. But I bought a couple of these because of the polyester. The higher the polyester, the better the color is from the sublimation, the ink. This is just um, a nice, soft, light tan. See what I'm saying? We should never be able to see stitching lines how they was in that other sweatshirt. But this is just... Um, it's a large, and I think this was a men's large. So this is definitely long enough to cover my booty, and I love that. I am definitely an oversized baggy girl. And then definitely a man's because my hands are like gone, disappeared. But that's okay, because I can pull them up or roll them. No biggie. Has the hood. It is soft inside. Um... It's not a thick sponge. It kind of has that feel to it, but it's a nice soft polyester and it's thinner. So it doesn't feel like a thick spongy feel to it. So I, I like this. I like that a lot. And I got it to go with these. I've never bought leggings from there, but I thought I'd try them. Seven nineteen. I think I got a large by re excuse me, by reading the sizes. Um, I knew they weren't going to be cloth, um, but I really like this print and the colors. I really like all that Aztec all the way down. But yeah, I, I really like these. But now I just, it's busy. So I just kind of got something tan solid to pull it out. Um, just a little outfit for here at home or run to the grocery or something, but it's a busy pair of pants. So I went ahead and got a plain shirt to calm the outfit down. They're nice at the bottom. These are very soft. I'm sure it's 100% polyester. I got them a large. 100%. Boy, they want you to know it's a large. You bought this size large. 100% poly. But I do like them. Um, one thing, too, about being short, because I'm 4'11 and a half. 
I cannot lose my half, at least not yet. Um, things with me, like, okay, I'm right here. The crotch of these is down here, so there is <laughs> this much difference. And I, I have that problem with a lot of pants. If I don't buy jeans that are short or in petite, my crotch on them are too long, which drives me crazy. But I'll just keep yanking them up. And if I have to yank them up enough, I'll just roll them down a couple of times. But I'll figure out how to make it work. So those were $7.19. Um, I got this for somebody. I can't say who in case they watch this. But it was $1.48 with a price adjustment. I actually get the little tiny decal and the big one. And I'm going to put the little one in the front for them. And the big one in the back. Oh, here it is. Let's see. I know it's there. Just keeps a good stick. Don't let go of it. It'll just re reapply itself again. Reseal itself, I guess. Um, it's kind of bent. I've gotten some where these are perfectly straight. But those are bent. This one's fine because it's smaller. But yeah, I thought those were really cute. And it says style authentic wear is what it's supposed to say on there. But yeah, I think she'll really like that. So for those two pieces, it was only $1.48 plus I got a price adjustment. So there's that. Oh, oh these are huge. I read and read the reviews too. These are not going to fit me. Seventeen twenty-one is what I paid for these jeans. Boy, I really got brave. If I get one pair of jeans, why not get two? Without knowing how the first ones are going to fit. Oh, no. Nope, I can't wear them. Maybe Emmy can. They're too big. 30 women jeans, but really nice jean material. Same as those others. They were really, really nice. I love the button down like that. I love the four, the five, six fly, button fly. Very cute. It's distressed. I don't mind that whitewash. Sometimes it can get a little cray cray with it, but that's not bad. And then they just kind of go down like that at the bottom. Um, it's got a little bit of the white here and there on the butt. I mean, they could really kind of distress it out and spread it out rather than looking like you just sat your butt cheeks and bleach. But... And then what, it's going to be in the back of your kneecaps or something, or your thigh, uh, calves. But anywho, they're cute. It is a very good denim quality. I'm actually really impressed with that. And same with the others. They're really nice, too. Um, Eighty-five percent cotton and fifty poly. So you know what? I will wash them, and I'll see. They're extremely long, but hey, may surprise myself. I've got boots with heels and things like that. We'll give it a whirl. <clears throat> it does have pockets. I'm sorry if I'm not telling that. It's got your pockets here. They're not huge deep, but good. My hand almost goes in. You've got your little pocket watch pocket on the one side, so that's nice. And these are not fake pockets, they're all real. You can stick your phone back there. Um, let me check this one out because I was still so flustered, I don't think I really looked. These are good pockets. I really like these. I love those too, but I really, these are really nice thin. They just feel so comfortable. And then you got your little pocket watch or whatever goes there. And then there's your other one. These are real pockets. So you can put your phone there too. They're not real short. I mean, real long. So oh, I'm using my phone to record. I was looking forward to put it in there and show you, but I can't. So we'll try them. That's all I can do. And if it doesn't fit me, I'll check with them. See if she likes it. I did get two of those. I believe one for my son and one for my husband. Three forty-eight with price adjustments. They're gray. 
excuse me, <coughs> it says cat and orange. And all the toboggans I bought so far are really good quality. I like them. And it's got the patch in there. I mean, they could have patched a little bit more. See, here I am trying to toot their horn and I might just cut this so it doesn't sit there and stick out like that. But it is embroidered in, I guess was my point I was trying to get to for I noticed that. But they're nice, thick hats. Very, very nice hats. They don't stink, really. It just smells like kind of new clothes. But I like that. This one is the exact same, so I'm not going to take it out of the bag. I guess I do need to try for another thumbnail at some point. Um, I like my Kiss sweatshirt, so let's give it a whirl. My lips full dry. Oh, can't see it. Okay, there's my thumbnail. Kind of not feeling it today. Nothing on you guys, I'm sorry. Definitely not trying to be a Debbie Downer. Um, this came by itself. These three items did. Um, but it was part of this haul. They just did it because of what it was, I guess, in case it broke or they didn't want to get all over the other items. $1.68 with a price adjustment. It is makeup. Decalu, Decalu. Decay, decay, I don't know. Yeah. So, let's see, it is an eyeshadow. Hmm. I like the colors, but I would probably won't wear the pinks. Um, there's the colors. Let's do the sparkle. And, can you see it? It's there a little bit. It's not real, real dark. Let's try this one here. And we'll put it here. It's got a darker pigment to it, but... Hmm. I don't know. For the price, I guess, I won't complain. $1.68 with the price adjustment. I mainly got it because I like sparkle makeup. As you can kind of see, I do. I like the shimmery. So I mainly just got it for like three of the colors in there. But maybe I just wasn't putting enough, you know, and you just have to work with it and put more till you get the color you like. But there was that. And I am not going to put it back in the box. It was mine. $2.75. This had a really good review, but I I don't know. It's coming from another country. You just never know what could be in things. $2.75. I should think like this before I order. But anyway, it brightens teeth, deep cleaning, and mouth guard. Three days, tooth powder, teeth bright, white, and five days. And this is what it is. And it ha I read the reviews, and it was like in the thousands, thousands and thousands that had bought it. So, mm, man, I wanted to, sorry give it a check myself just you never know it might work it's powdery I mean I don't know if you guys can see that but it's like a salt really fine I can't even get it up out of there for you guys to see but oh well it doesn't really stink and it's a full bottle 2.7 ounces um, clean your mouth with warm water before using. Then wipe the tooth surface with a toothbrush. So brush your teeth, I guess. Rinse with water until teeth are clean. Doesn't tell you how to mix. I guess you just put it on there and add water. And it'll foam up in your mouth. And I don't, I don't know. We'll see. Two seventy five. I need to think more sometimes before I buy. Hands feel a little sticky from the stuff I spilt. 314 12-tone color palette. Mm -hmm. That's weird. 
little bag. Comes like this. And looks like. Oh, I like the colors. Looks like I can't open it. It looks like I cannot open it. Wow. I'm tired, you guys. I'm not gonna sit here and fight with it this evening. I just I don't I don't have the patience tonight. I really do. I'm sorry. But I loved all the shimmery ones in here. But I do really like all those neutral colors. Jeez. That's just ridiculous, and there's nothing sealing it on the sides. Not even a button to push. Ugh, I'm gonna break my nail. Okay, I'm done with that. But anyway, it's really pretty. I do like the colors. I feel like I'm letting you guys down tonight. I should have not done this right now just because I don't, I don't feel real great just because I didn't have much sleep. more things. <laughs> um, two twenty four is what I paid for this one. So it's pink. I think this is one of the changing color ones with your lip. Bioishi Cosmetics Sparkles Magic Lipstick. Um, it didn't come with the box. It's just in a little container. Oh, it smells good. Everything's pink. Ugh. I don't like... Definitely don't like that pink. Okay. Well, if your girl likes pink, um, it's a pretty pink, but... Mm, not my kind of pink. But at least it doesn't stink and smell medicine-y or chemically like that one. It doesn't have a bad smell at all to it. Um, it's very smooth when you put it on. But yeah, I just... Yeah. I'm not into the pink colors. Emmy come home from school, so I've got to talk about it. This goes in all five of the kids' stockings. They'll each get one. And it's an icy. I paid $3.59 for five. So. You get cherry. Like I said, it's five for $3.59 and we have five stockings for the kids. And you get grape. Don't look over here. These are Christmas thingies. Okay. <laughs> Watermelon. That's the airhead. These are all like little chopsticks. But these were the icy brand. And this right here is the airhead watermelon and airhead blue raspberry and icy blue raspberry so they'll just each get one in their stocking Whispering, I don't have to now. Um, I got this for me, it was $9.89. My husband has all kinds of stuff, say so we the people, and I don't have any yet, so I wanted to get me one. This is men's, 
Um, feels nice, a little sponge to it. It's a nice spongy polyester. It's not thick and spongy, it's thinner. So I don't know, I like it. It's really soft in the hood, soft all inside. And it says, we the people, it just has a flag on there. You do have your two drawstrings. Um, it is a men's large men's large polyester and yep I like the length comes right down over my legs my thighs covers my booty but 1776 we the people I really like that so that's what it looks like up close got it on black they have these in all kinds of colors most of the sweatshirts I show they have in multiple different colors um but yeah oh and I tell you that, which most of them do, but I still want to let you know, it's got the one pocket that goes all the way through. So you do have a pocket there. It's black and you just really can't see it, but it's there. I promise. But yeah, I really like this. Um, I'm least disappointed with this because of the stitching. I am probably going to try to do a refund because... The stitching is very loose. I've already showed you once, but it's loose stitching. I can see all the white going across in there. And yeah, I don't like that. This is normal to see that, but not this, you know, here, I won't even pull it. Not this stuff. I don't like that, which is a bummer. I mean, I hope it's gonna last through some washes, but that, I really like that too. Oh well. But yeah, I'll see if I can get my money back. You like to take a couple pictures and click it on there. Um, make sure you look at your whole haul because if once you submit it and if you notice something on another item later, it only kind of seems like it lets you do one request per per order. So last time I had two or three. There was some chipping on the salt and pepper shaker that I had gotten and the material and something I didn't really like. So it must have been two things. And I put them both together. Um, but I found out through another one that I was doing, I had two things and I only noticed the first one and I did it and got my credit. Then later I noticed something else on another item and I tried to do it and it wouldn't let me. So I would think I was gonna have to mail it back or something. I'm not dealing with all the mailing back thing stuff. So I will probably definitely do that one. Um, I'll try on the jeans, let you know. Just bit my lip. How you quit that? Bad habit. It's a nervous fidgety habit too. Um, I'll play around with this little thing and see what I can do with it. But yeah, so maybe I just need to get a little bit more hair down and foo foo it some. I'll give it a whirl and see. All right guys. That's all I have on this haul. So thank you so much for watching. So sorry that my mood is just kind of, I'm just, I'm really tired, but um, I had stuff to show you guys and I wanted to make sure I did it. Um, so it's done and I will do my best to not forget my phone again and take this to work so I can upload it for you. So um, yeah, I don't know if you guys are noticing too, not many price adjustments and when you do, not maybe a penny or 25 cents 35 cents well i got one yesterday i think it was it's in my next haul and it's a sweatshirt and i got four dollars and 35 cents back off of it which was nice because i was going through this dry spell of just a penny here and there i was like man what's going on timu i like my price adjustments i know this stuff is already low price but i look forward to those price adjustments and the credits but um yeah okay i'm all done and I thought she was going to jump in the shower, but I think she's just in the bathroom. So she can probably hear me. And, um, all right. Till next time, guys. And have a blessed work week. And toodaloo.